Hey everybody, welcome back to game night. It is part two of how well can you 90s. Um, a little rundown if you've never played game night. This is a new series we just started last Wednesday. So every Wednesday I am going to post a series of questions from the 90s. Um, it's four weeks worth of questions. If you happen to play all four weeks on the fifth week, we are going to take a break of questions, and that week will be the giveaway. If you played all four weeks, you will be in, entered into the giveaway, and it's most likely going to be a small gift card. Um, so make sure you guys play. You have basically up until that fifth Wednesday to play. So um, if you missed last week, you can go ahead back over there and play that one. And to make things easier this week, I'm going to say it up front. When I do put the questions, uh, when I put the answers at the end of the video, I will be putting A, B, and C. So make sure whenever you are writing your answers, um, it's easier to check it if you just write A, B, or C. So, are you guys ready to kick this off? Because I am. And I'm just going to tell you all a little hint. There's going to be a question that it sounds like I'm repeating more than once. It's not me, so if you know the answer, you're guaranteed to get it right every time it comes up because these are pre-printed um, on these cards by the person who makes this game. So I'm going to go ahead and read all of the questions. Um, I'm going to pause between each one for a few seconds. If you need to hit pause, go ahead and do that so you can have enough time to answer the questions. I will not be giving the answers in between. They'll all come up on the end of the video. If you will pause it at the end, you'll be able to see all the answers. So, let's get started. Question numero uno. There are going to be 26 questions, by the way. What 90s gum had a zebra on it? A, ouch. B, fruit stripe. Or C, hubba bubba. What 80s show is the 90s show Fraser, Fraser a spinoff of? A. Wings B. Married with Children or C. Cheers What fashion was first popular in the 70s and returned in the 90s? A. Corduroy B. Velvet or C. Flannel what character is the beast in the 90s film The Sandlot? A. A famous baseball player. B. The neighbor. Or C. A dog. In a little hot. Which of these Jim Carrey films was not released in the 90s? Was not. Make sure y'all heard that not. Um. A. The Mask B. Me, Myself, and Irene or C. Liar, Liar What are scrunchies? A. Candy B. Shoes or C. Hair Accessory What was the name of the company to create this 90's toy Tamagotchi? A. Sega Toys. Sega Toys. Sorry, I said that wrong. B. Bandai. And C. Hasbro. Let me repeat those answers. A. Sega Toys. B. Bandai. And C. Hasbro. I'm not sure if I'm saying that 100% correctly. In the X-Files, what was Mulder's nickname? A. Spooky B. Sherlock or C. Dick What was What movie was Robin Williams' first animated film? A. Aladdin B. Fern Gully, The Last Rainforest or C. Robots. 
Which character from Beavis and Butthead has their own show? A. Earl B. Mr. Anderson or C. Daria What style of shirt did the grunge movement make popular during the 90s? A. Flannel B. Polo C. Jean What was the original name of the Starburst Sweets candy? A. Juicy Fruits B. Star Fruits or C. Opal Fruits We're about halfway, guys. Which hit TV show from the 90s was produced by David Hasselhoff? A. Friends B. Full House or C. Baywatch One of the fashion trends of the 90s was Tevis. Tevis. T-E-V-A-S. Tevis. What kind of footwear was this? A. Sandal. B. Boot. Or C. Sneaker. In the 90s, what was originally used to access the internet? A. Google. B. America Online or C. AT&T What are scrunchies? A. Candy B. Shoes or C. Hair Accessory In Saved by the Bell What were Zach and Kelly dressed up as the night they broke up. A. Romeo and Juliet. B. Mickey and Minnie Mouse. C. King and Queen. On Friends, what was the name of Ross's monkey? A. Marcel. B. Caesar. Or C. George. In the 90s, what candy used the slogan, The Fresh Maker? A. Chicklets B. Altoids Or C. Mentos In what city does Matlock take place? A. Atlanta, Georgia B. Miami, Florida Or C. Chicago, Illinois What range of cars were launched by GM in 1990? A. Chevrolet B. Saturn or C. Cadillac The first bagless cyclonic vacuum cleaner cyclonic, cyclonic vacuum cleaner was sold in 1993 by what company? A. Dyson B. Dirt Devil or C. Hoover Alright you guys last two cards four questions to go An IBM supercomputer beat the chess champion Gary Kasparov Kasparov for the first time in 1996 What was the computer's name? A. Deep Blue B. Wolper or C. Deep Thought Rap was just becoming well known in the 90's. Which artist had the first number one rap single? A. Tupac B. Jay-Z or C. Vanilla Ice All right, let's finish off these last two. Which musical star star was knighted by Queen Elizabeth II on February 24, 1998? A. Sir Paul McCartney B. Sir Elton John or C. Sir Rod Stewart 
which superheroes had the ability to fight in animal transportation? A. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles B. Transformers or C. Mighty Morphin Power Rangers Alright guys, that was all 26 questions. And now, I want you guys to comment down below how many you got correct. And just, just to ver clarify, it does not matter if you missed all 26. It does not. As long as you played all four weeks, that's all that matters. If you have a comment, all four videos, when the fifth video rolls around for the giveaway, your name will be entered. Um, you got to be subscribed, obviously, and verifiable. U.S. Um, shipping address, that's just how it's got to be right now. Um, but yeah. Don't think you can only be in this giveaway because you answered so many correct. No, not at all. Um, this week, I believe I missed the same. Nope, I missed more this week than I did last week. I missed nine. So, how well did you 90s this week? Did you do better than me? I hope so. Because nine? Hmm. Not horrible. Not my best. So, I hope you guys are enjoying this series and are playing along each week. Um, so, yeah. Make sure you guys come back next week to play week three for the third installment of How Well Can You 90s. And uh, I will see y'all next week for game night. Bye.